Established over 70 years ago, the Committee on Commodity Problems, CCP, is FAO's oldest technical committee. CCP tracks agricultural commodity markets around the world to help improve their efficiency and transparency, and increase global food security. This is in line with the 2030 Sustainable Development Goals, with a strong focus on ending world hunger and promoting sustainable agriculture. Over the years, CCP has proven to be an active, consistent voice when natural emergencies, shocks and volatile situations affected world markets and trade. Even in the most difficult circumstances, it has brought governments and other relevant parties together to foster dialogue, help build positive relations, and promote coordinated action to address commodity and trade issues. For example, when the energy crisis hit in the 70s, CCP helped develop trade policies in agri-food markets and reduce tariffs to help stabilize global markets and decrease food prices to consumers. In 1995, CCP highlighted the impact of the Uruguay Round Agreement on agriculture and encouraged the world to focus on developing countries and the new trade opportunities, stressing the importance of market access. When the prices of major agricultural commodities like coffee, sugar, meat, oils, and cotton hit an historical low in the early 2000s, CCP identified several interventions that helped stabilize global markets. Between 2008 and 2012, when food prices soared again, CCP helped review the institutions that governed the markets and made sure that the voices of smallholder farmers in low-income countries were heard. In 2012, CCP members confirmed the terms of reference of the committee and expanded the bureau from three to seven members, welcoming one representative from each regional group. It also developed a strategy to involve more intergovernmental organizations, civil society, and the private sector in its work. Through global initiatives such as International Tea Day, which was agreed by the committee in 2018, CCP helps promote the production, consumption, and trade of agricultural commodities to a wider audience. More recently, during the COVID-19 pandemic, CCP encouraged governments to avoid policies that could affect the functioning of agri-food markets during the crisis. It also emphasized the importance of maintaining food and other international standards in line with the World Trade Organization Agreement on Sanitary and Phytosanitary Measures WTO SPS agreement. Over the years, CCP has played a central role in many of FAO's initiatives and accomplishments in international cooperation. Through its annual submissions to the UN High-Level Political Forum on Sustainable Development, CCP contributes towards the realization of the 2030 Agenda and the SDGs. CCP continues to be an essential global forum for bringing countries together, positively influencing food security and sustainability worldwide by ensuring more transparent, efficient and inclusive agricultural commodity markets and trade. The work of CCP supports the needed transformation to more efficient, inclusive, resilient and sustainable agri-food systems for better production, better nutrition, a better environment, and a better life, leaving no one behind.